have Kylar joining us. Congratulations. Hello, guys. How are you feeling? Uh, pretty good. Expected? <laughs> Expected win? Of course. Of course. <laughs> so tell, tell me what it looked like coming into today for this matchup in particular. I mean, for Vitality. I mean, sitting across from them, they're known to be pretty good. Yeah, they are pretty good, but uh, <coughs> of course we are under God, underdogs, so we uh, we feel pretty confident. Like we don't have anything to lose, so it was pretty easy to play. Like without pressure, we we didn't have to win. It was all on them, so it was pretty nice for us. You guys have had some close games in the play and right like where you were able to come back that mirage game versus the mongols as well how much did those games mean to you you know how much did that strengthen you so to speak coming into this match now against vitality yes we are a new team we are struggling a lot like with beginning of the matches because uh, a lot of chaos at the beginning a lot of emotions so <coughs> the comeback that we made against Mongols it shows that we are pretty good mentally already. And when we pl start playing our game, we are really strong. We just need to keep doing that. And I think it will get even better. Yeah, the game against Mongols yesterday, it looked like you gave up a lot of first kills on your CT side especially, and it, things weren't looking good for you. What was different today where, I mean, we can't just say, oh yeah, we're just hitting our shots better. Was there something else that was going on as well? Or was it actually just, yeah, we just didn't give up first bloods, we hit our shots? Uh, against Mongols, it was a bit different because they were the underdogs and we kind of played, uh, I don't want say disrespectfully but yeah a bit more reckless uh, and against vitality we said that we can give them anything we can't just uh, lose 2v4 and just collapse so we played like against australis we took every advantage to the full you know, on Vertigo, obviously, you did a lot of great work, but on this map, especially on Nuke, we picked out a couple of rounds too early on on the T side, where you were sort of the tip of the spear for your team, right? Going through, you know, the door play that you had first and the following round going down once. Is this something that you just enjoy doing in general, that you specifically knew that maybe there was a gap against Vitality that you could use it? Talk us a little bit through that. I have... I think I have the most uh, entry place in my team uh, and I like drawing first, so it's, ni it's nice to have spawns, finally. <laughs> <laughs> but, but yeah, I mean, uh, we knew it will work, so yeah. Uh, so Kuben said just do it in, uh, before the match and I did it. <laughs> <laughs> what if it was always that easy, right? <laughs> what are we looking at here in this round? It's <laughs> our... I probably have a strat from nine. <laughs> <laughs> you got a couple of those saved up from nine? A couple strats from those times? Yeah. So you use them on other maps, not just Vertigo. Of course. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Well, you know, obviously, this this was a big victory for you guys. You came here, and for Ents, there are a lot of question marks. Is there anything that you want to say now? I mean, you've beaten Vitality. You made your way all the way to this point. Is there anything you want to tell the fans at home? We are coming to spot it. <laughs> okay, hell yeah, it, it is that simple. Well, uh, look, man, I, I think we'll get you out of here if, if you're okay with that. We appreciate you joining us. It's okay. Unless you, <laughs> unless you want to stick around, you're more than welcome to stick around, but this is where we start doing our, our cleanup and our housekeeping and whatnot. So, <laughs> and our Air Force Aim High. What was I even thinking? That's the United States Air Force Aim High. Who do you think it is, Yanko? Hades, maybe? He had a great game on you. Hades for sure. Hades for sure? <laughs> there we go. Hades for sure. <laughs> yeah, uh, he, he was definitely there. Go ahead, man. You're good. Uh, he was definitely in the building. We talk about feeling yourself, and this was it. Yeah, absolutely. You've been a little bit up and down here and there, but on this decider map, I mean, on the T side, he was an unstoppable force right there. The round towards the end of the half where he gets four kills with the AWP as uh, Ants is splitting the upper bomb side. We see doing some work in the second pistol too. Really tremendous impact from Hades on, on Nuke. And it looks like a sharp contrast actually to how he was looking yesterday and in previous days where it used to look like he couldn't hit a shot, and today it looked like he couldn't miss a shot. So, I mean, he had an in insane performance here, and it's not like he was just like sitting around in the back. He was getting in their faces. He was getting dirty, down and dirty. But 
I mean, a lot of this focus right now is on Ents playing really well, but on the flip side of things, Vitality was also kind of like off their game. They were missing a lot of shots. They were standing in the open, getting shot on the side. And in, in all these two versus, two versus twos, one versus ones, they were just like aiming at the sky. Like, what are you aiming what, at? Are you, you know? not supposed to do that? I don't know. That sounds, <laughs> I don't know. Anyway, look, what I did you see in round 12, though? Like,